younger siblings from being seen on Tyson Dan. I am an aerial yoga teacher, a yoga teacher. I'm also certified in Pio and Shift, which are cardio classes. I can post those as well. So if you're interested in any of that, in yoga or aerial yoga or doing some cardio, subscribe to my channel, like the video, give it a big thumbs up. Um, hit that little bell icon so you get notified every time I upload new content. Um, let me know what you'd like to see because I will make videos just for you. This is my first aerial video I'm making. It was requested by Lindsay. She asked me to show a couple variations of mermaid pose. So I'm going to do that. And I also know one of the variations my, some of the students in my classes are working on as well. It would be helpful if I could slow that down so they can watch it over and over. So this is for all of you guys as well. Um, I hope you enjoy it. We're going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to put my little clicker down for my camera. And then I'm going to show you where my hammock is. So I have the hammock at hip flexor height. So it's right about here. We're going to be getting upside down briefly, but not for long. Our hat's not really going to go towards the earth. And you need the hammock a little bit lower so that you can step that leg through easier. Okay, so it could even be a little bit lower than this. Um, you just want to be able to get that leg out when we come out of one of the poses, all right? I'm going to show you the first variation of mermaid pose. I'm going to bring the fabric to my low back. This is called a cross back straddle. And we're just going to lean the back in the hammock. The legs are going to go high. You're going to wrap one leg. You're going to bring the other leg down to the floor. And you're going to stand up. I have my left leg down. Now, I'm on point with the right toes. Can you see how this fabric is underneath my armpit? And then it's wrapping underneath my thigh. That's what's going to keep me safe. I'm going to lean back to the left. I'm going to take both hands to the pose of the fabrics. And I'm going to point through the right toes. And then I'm just going to lift the left leg up. And I hope you can see that. That's mermaid pose one. Mermaid pose two. Extend the bottom leg. Point through the toes. Squeeze the thighs together. Turn towards the back wall. Open the arm. And you are in mermaid pose. And then you come out of it. You come back down. And this is where you got to step through. So you'll unwrap. You'll just lift that leg up and bring it out. Now I'm going to show you on the back side so you can see the flip, okay? So I'm going to turn around this way. Cross back straddle, lean back. I'll wrap the left leg this time. Put the right foot down, extend through the left leg. So you have that fabric is across underneath my armpit. That's what's going to keep me safe. I'm going to lean back, both the bottom leg up, Take the foot to the bottom calf, and you can open here. Now, if you want to take the second version, zip the thighs together, turn, and then open up here. And that's mermaid pose. We're going to come out of it, right foot down, unwrap, remove the left leg. So, mermaid variations one and two. This next mermaid is a little bit trickier. I'm going to spread the fabric out. I'm going to bunch it up about five times. I'm going to sit in the middle. I'm going to kick the legs out. So I'm hoping to stay um, in the camera side. I hope you can see me. I'm going to have the fabric underneath my shoulder, underneath my armpits. I want some fabric over my legs like a blanket. So you can't really see it. But I have extra fabric. I'm gonna bring it over my legs. And my fabric's going kind of over my knees. Now, I'm gonna take on my right, my right, I'm gonna pull the fabric down like that. Can you see? And now, this is my right, this is my left. I'm gonna drop my knees to the left. So my knees are not going to the right. I'm gonna bend my knees and take them over to the left. Okay, I'm going to climb my left hand way high. Now, before we go further, see this hole? I'm going to climb around this hole all the way through that side. I'm going around and through. That's the part that's tricky for people. We're going around and through. Okay, so knees to the left, 
left arm high. I'm gonna use arm muscle to pull up. I'm gonna pull up like this. Can you see? I'm three, I'm gonna straighten my legs. And I am in mermaid pose. You have to kick with your feet to get up there. You can bend the knees. You can hang out. Maybe open up. That is mermaid pose. To come out of it, you just fall out of it. And there you are. I hope that's helpful. Another uh, variation of mermaid, if you don't like that, bring the fabric here and just open up. And it's like you have this little tail, right? Those are the variations of mermaid. I hope it's helpful. Let me know below if you liked it. And I hope to see you around soon, okay? I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.